cozy. <laughs> Rosie and Jim, Rosie and Jim, tagging along on the old rag doll. Rosie and Jim, Rosie and Jim, and John he steers the boat. We go to play and have a look with Rosie's bag. Jim's drawing book, the world drifts by, the window frame, and Rosie and Jim we play our games. <coughs> Rosie and Jim, Rosie and Jim, finding stories every day. Rosie and Jim, Rosie and Jim, and John he writes them down. <laughs> Hello, I'm John. You saw me steering the boat earlier on, but that's not my real work. My real work is writing books, and they're books for children just like you. I'm making a new one just now. It's all about Rosie and Jim. They're my two rag dolls that I have on the boat. I like to pretend that they come to life. And I get ideas for the stories about them from the things I see as I travel on my boat. What shall I put in my story today? Well, it's a cloudy day, so I'll start with that. One cloudy day. And then I'll draw the canal with my two blue pens, like this. And my boat is just here. So I'll put this picture of it on the book to show the place. And now, I'll be on my way. Now, I'll get my life jacket on. Mustn't forget that. Need that for safety. Let's have a look. I'm at Bumblehole Boating Centre today, and I'm having a look at my book to see where to go. I'm going to go all down here, and head for Birmingham. Let's get going. Oh, a rainbow. Haven't seen one of those for a long time. What lovely colours. It's rather narrow here with lots of trees hanging over the water. Here we go, Jim, where there's going to be lots of trees. Mm, all the way up and over the coloured rainbow to where the trees are. <laughs> oh, Jim, all the trees are coming in the boat. What a place like going through a forest. Leaves, Jim! Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, these leaves, Rosie, they're greener than my drawing. <laughs> Can you send me some more, please? Thank you. Oh, trees have leaves, oh, greeny green, the greenest green I've ever seen. <laughs> oh, dear, poor old rag doll. Oh, it's getting a good scratching from these trees. <laughs> what, what was that noise? Rosie! It sounded like the gnashing of monster's teeth, Jim! Oh, 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 don't say that! Oh, no. Ah! Rosie! Oh, no. The monster is eating the boat! Scritch, scratch, bumpity bump, the boat tips up and the cups go jump. Splish, splash, jiggity jog, is it a boat or is it a frog? <laughs> wah, wah, wah! Ha <laughs> ha! Duck's seen the monster, Jim, and, and it's got big wide eyes and a big wide mouth. Oh, Rosie, w what colour is it? Uh, well... It's green and shiny. I'm scared. Oh, how big is it? Uh, that big. 
Yeah. How big? That big. Well, well, look, Noggin, it's not going to bite you. <gasps> Rosie, <laughs> that's not a monster. It's a frog. I know. <laughs> hey, Rosie. Yeah? I'm going to paint that frog. Oh. <laughs> Rosie, I haven't got any green paint. Oh, look what a mess I've made of my boat. I've scratched it all the way along. It must have been with driving too close to those trees. I'll have to go and get some paint to patch it up. Now, what colours do I need? I certainly need some uh, yellow, and I need some green, and I'll need some blue. I'd better go and find a shop to buy some paint. Luckily, I'm in the town, so the shops aren't far away. <laughs> Look at all the cars rushing past. Yeah. And all the people. All the people in the street rushing by on tap tap feet. Buying this and buying that. Have no time to stop and chat. Good morning. Good morning, you. Oh, I've got trouble. I've got a boat on the canal and I've scratched it on some trees. I need some paint. I see I've come to the right place. Yeah, the colour um, Well, I'll need some yellow. Yep. And uh, blue. Better have a brush, I think. Do you sell brushes? Take your brush out. Oh, today, yes, right? yes. Um, that's a nice size. Yes, I'll have one of those brushes. You want a brush cleaner? A brush? Yes, I'd better have something to clean the brush, hadn't I? Did you have it? Yes, it'll get sticky. Well, there's something else I want. I can't remember what it is. It's a terrible memory, you know. Anyway. No, it's not a scraper. Oh, I might remember. I can always come back. No, it's not Rosie, I need some green paint. I know that. I can remember. I'll go and get you some. Never mind. I can come back later on. Oh. Well, Joe usually do that. What was that? It must have been the wind. Aye. I didn't notice any wind when I came in, though. No, no, me. It's very strange, isn't it? Now, what was it that I... Oh, I can't think what it was. Axel? Axel. Anshaw? No, it's not a saw, no. Flouting no. trowel? Planting up trowel? No. Anshaw? Jose! I want the green paint! Yeah, there's a green one. No! Not the red one. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, green. Toe armor? No. Pinama? Pinama? Moon armor? You've got so many things here. What time do you close? Six o'clock. Six o'clock? Oh, well, I can always come back if I remember what it was that uh, I was thinking right, about. Worship. Oh, what a memory. I mustn't forget to pay, must I? There's that door again. Ah, oh, you better have... It needs a... I think do that. It needs a sprig on it, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> well done, Rosie, well done! Come on! Green paint, we got green paint, we got green... Right, I'll start with the blue. Oh, that looks a lot better. Lovely, nice, clean, fresh colour. Green paint. <laughs> New green paint from the shop. Shoppy shop. Da -ba -ba. <laughs> Rosie? This new green paint doesn't work, it's all brown. <laughs> Noggin, you've still got red paint on it. You have to wash it out. Mm. There we are. That's the blue and the yellow finished. Just a bit. Now, I need to... Oh! Green. I haven't got any green paint. Now what am I going to do? I should have made a list, shouldn't I, before I went to the shop. Oh, dear. I wonder if I could make some green. Perhaps I can, if I mix the paints. Take the yellow first, and I'll pour some in this jar. And 
and put some glue in with it. Then I'll mix it up. There we are. Lovely green. It's worked. Magic. And I can paint the green. Lovely. Just the job. Wash the brush, wash the brush, then the colours won't all smudge. Did you know, Jim, you can make green by mixing two other colours together? Really? Yeah. Which colours? Um, uh, can you remember? Rosie, which colours do I mix to get mm. green? Um, well, there's blue. Oh, blue. Yes. Right, and uh, which other colour, Rosie? Um, well, there's blue. And, yes. Um, what? Blue? Oh, is um, it is it red? Um, no. Um, is it purple? No. Um, oh. Is it orange? No. Um, oh. Mix blue and what? Um, blue and yellow. <laughs> blue and yellow. Yellow. Yeah. <gasps> it's magic. <laughs> Rosie, I've made some green. <laughs> See, blue and yellow. What did I tell you? There we are. That's the rag doll painted just as good as new. I'll tidy away now and get on with my story. I have lots of ideas now for my Rosie and Jim stories. And now I'm going to write in my book the story all about Rosie and Jim and what they would have got up to if they could have come to life today. One cloudy day, Rosie and Jim were chugging along in the good boat rag doll when they came to a dark forest. In the middle of the forest sat the Frog King. It's horrid, said Rosie. Where have all the colours gone, said Jim. I've swallowed them, said the Frog King. Noggin, said Rosie, and she looked up. Look, she said. There was a band of colour going right across the sky. It's a rainbow, said Jim. They sailed their boat to the end of the rainbow. There they found three pots of paint. A red pot, a blue pot and a yellow pot. Now we can put the colours back in the world, said Rosie. But there are only three colours here, said Jim. We can make all the others if we mix them, said Rosie. You'll see. And she was right. Rosie and Jim painted their boat. Then they painted the grass, the trees, and the sky. And the Frog King was so cross that he went green all over. But he never swallowed the colours again. Rosie! Rosie and Tim, Rosie and Tim, talking and long on the old back door. I'm off now to see what I can find to make a new story for next time. So I'll say goodbye. Goodbye! The end. <laughs>